in front of 3814 Timber Ridge Road. We are going to walk you through this house since that's how a lot of things are done now. Virtual tour. Um, this is a five bedroom, three and a half bath home on the golf course in Brander Mill. So let's go in and take a look. There's been some updates lately to it and let's go look around. There's some noise outside. So let's head in. Um, as we head in, you can see split and stairway going up. We've got um, living room over to the right. And it feeds on through into the dining room, which has French doors looking out onto the golf course. There's your beautiful view. Hardwood floors. Um, this is a, the uh, upgraded kitchen. We've got granite counters, brand new appliances, and it is wide open into the family room, which is great for entertaining or for hanging out with the family. And it's got a really large pantry over here, which we all like a large pantry. But brand new tile, brand new counters, brand new cabinets, and as I said, brand new stainless steel appliances. Got several drawers, a little side butler's pantry over on here. Um, you've got wood stove in the family room, beautiful brick area, and uh, also again a view of the golf course. And you saw a guy go by in his golf cart. Beautiful day outside. Let's head back. So this house is a little unique in that it has two first floor masters. Um, would make a great situation for extended family, um, anything that you could think of. It, but it's an interesting way out. So let's go take a look. Um, this is one of the masters. Come on in. We have a cedar closet. Walk in. A brand new carpet in here. And paint. Um, we've also got this extra closet. Yeah, his and hers. <laughs> um, this is the main bedroom area. This was an addition at one point, so you have a, a little bit of an architectural feature here with the brick wall and some cabinet space. And again, French doors with a view out to the golf course and your own little balcony patio. Great place for morning coffee. There we go, somebody walking their dog with their golf cart. <laughs> Great community here in Brandon now. Back up. Okay, and we've got, as I said, this is a master suite. So we've got a bathroom in here. Large, large bathroom. And you've got two vanities, extra large cabinet. You've got a, uh, Stand up walk in shower and the extra long soaking tub. You can see we've got brand new windows in here too, they're real pretty. Very wooded lots. You've got the water closet over here. Okay, and let's check out the second first floor master bedroom. In the middle, we've got laundry area with some shelving space. We're back in the center hallway again. There's a half bath. So we've come back to the front door and before we went to the right into the living room, if you turn left, you come into um, an office space with built-in bookshelves, panel walls, wood. Not that ugly paneling from the 70s. And that leads you through to the second master bedroom. 
which is on the front of the house. You've got extra large closet with some built-in shelving. And you also have its own master bath. Vanity and tub and shower. So makes a great guest quarters, mother-in-law suite, uh, multi-generational home, could be a lot of uses. Let's go on and head upstairs. There are three bedrooms and one bathroom upstairs. You can see brand new carpet up here. So that's plastic on it. Um, off to the right is our first bedroom. We have two closets. Okay. And a view over that golf course again. Um, this is an extra space in the um, in the hallway, kind of a storage space, really kind of neat area. Um, the previous owners have some built-in shelves. We've got some file cabinets and some shelving back in here. Great storage space in the hallway. This is the third bathroom. It's a shared bathroom for all bedrooms up here. Got large vanity and a shower and tub combo. Your second bedroom upstairs. You got your closet, alcove window. Um, right across from that is a little open area you could use as a seating area or shelving. And then, but it opens up the light to that golf course view again. And we've got a another little storage area. Let's see, is there a light there? There we go. In the hallway. You will not be want for areas to put things. And this bedroom here is the other one. The two closets. And then you've got this extra little space down here. Be great for reading nook or desk or little hideaway spot and this is on the front of the house we're gonna head on back downstairs there's a so we can show you the back side of the house back down the hallway there is a attic access right there Brand new windows, brand new carpet. It's been recently painted. So head back through the hallway into the kitchen and family room area. And it has a, a, a room, a little a Florida room, I guess you would call it, off the side here, off the kitchen, that has a hot tub in it. Um, we've got some skylights, let the light in. This hot tub is working. It's uh, that recently been maintained and is up and working. Uh, we can turn on the jets. There you go. Hello, they go by. If you really need some heat massage. Yeah, they back off. Um, and then also is the deck off of here. Another set of French doors out to the deck space. Great big huge deck with some built-in seating and overlooking that beautiful golf course. We got beautiful landscaping out here, trees, azaleas, little walkways. Um, this house also has a one and a half car garage. Let's go check that out. A walkway with a gate out to the front. Only one and a half car 
our garage. It actually has a little um, ladder up to some more storage area up there. I'm not crawling up there, <laughs> but you can imagine. So you've got extra storage up top, plenty of room for a vehicle and some workspace as well. Okay. That was our tour of 3814 Timber Ridge. Um, this house is currently vacant, so if you do want to come see it in person, that is not a problem, low risk. Um, just give us a call and we'll get you in. All right, take care, bye.